Hello, I'm Bella Dinzar. I'm the Vice Chairman of the National Transportation Safety Board. The NTSB is launching a GO team to Hoboken, New Jersey to investigate the crash of a New Jersey transit train that occurred at approximately 9 a.m. this morning. Before I go any further, I'd like to express on behalf of the entire NTSB our condolences and sympathies to everyone who was affected by the accident today. The NTSB team will be led by Mr. Jim Southworth, who will serve as the investigator in charge. He's accompanied by NTSB staff with expertise in a multidisciplinary range of activities, including operations, mechanics, track, signals, human performance, and survival factors. Also accompanying the team are members of the NTSB's Transportation Disaster Assistance uh, Office and the Office of Public Affairs. Our TDA specialists are already working closely with local officials in order to assist them in their efforts to assist everyone who is affected by this accident. We expect to arrive in Hoboken later today. And for the latest information on media briefings, I encourage you to go to our website, which is ntsb.gov, and also follow us on our Twitter handle, which is at NTSB underscore newsroom. Again, we are just launching our GO team, so we'll have more information after we arrive on scene and begin the investigation, and we'll be sure to get that to you as soon as we have it. Now, I think I have time for two or three questions. If you would raise your hand, identify yourself, and I will call on you. Uh, yes, sir. Jonathan with the Star Ledger. Any sense yes, sir. of the absence of positive train control? That's something you're going to be looking at in the accident. The question is, will we be looking at positive train control? Absolutely. Uh, PTC has been one of our priorities. We know that it can prevent uh, accidents. As Whether it is involved in this accident, that is definitely one of the things that we will look at carefully. Uh, yes. Dave Shepard, Central Reuters. First, can you confirm how many people have been killed and injured in the incident? So the question is, uh, could we confirm how many people have been killed or injured? And uh, you've probably seen the media reports, but we we are there to investigate the cause of this accident, so we'll be working with the local authorities for that. Well, yes. Are you looking at the similarities between this crash and the one that happened in 2011 at the same station? The question is, will we be looking at the similarities between this crash and the crash that occurred uh, in 2011? And yes, we will. That was a crash that occurred at the same station on Mother's Day in 2011, and we always look at the past history and every other factor. But Right now, we are going to hit the ground running. I have a team ready to get on the plane with me right now. We have others on their way in uh, cars and trains. So we may have another news briefing later this afternoon. And if we do, we'll let you know. But regardless, we will hit the ground running and let you know what happens. Thank you. Thank you.